guys, welcome back. Uh, this is the third and final video about uh, Zero Code NFT Launchpad walkthrough. So if you are just joining, uh, make sure to, to watch the previous two videos where I explain how to create your smart contract without writing any code, uh, how to deploy your minting website that is connected to the smart contract. And in this video, we'll actually look at the final step, which would be to deploy your smart contract on the mainnet. So in my smart contract panel, I will click on deploy to mainnet. And the first thing you will see is the MetaMask is, ask, is asking us to switch the network because currently we are on Rinkeby test network. And in order to deploy the smart contract on mainnet, we have to actually switch to the mainnet uh, network. So I'll switch the network. And uh, this, is the, this is where you will have to actually purchase um, the, the voucher to deploy the um, to deploy the smart contract. So I will do PayPal. And I will push this off the screen so that I can, um, I'll actually pause the video here uh, while I'm entering my uh, PayPal information and I'll come back in a sec. All right, my uh, PayPal transaction went through. And now I can actually go ahead and do the mainnet deployment. The gas, the gas fee will vary based on the network conditions. Um, but as you can see, with all the features that we added, which was delayed reveal, whitelist, um, payment splitting, and airdrop, uh, the fee for the deployment is actually not, not bad at all. Uh, it will usually fluctuate anywhere from uh, 0.18 ETH to 0.3 ETH. And I actually don't have any ETH on my account, so I won't uh, confirm. Um, but this is something I want to show you as well. So if you actually reject here because, um, I don't know, you're, you, know, you want to wait longer or you want to wait for the better um, price, the, you know, the better um, deployment fee because maybe the network will slow down. Um, so if you click your account, you'll actually see that you have one credit. So your, um, you know, you can still deploy the smart contract later. You won't be asked to pay again. Uh, or even you can use this credit to deploy a different smart contract. Maybe you don't want to deploy this one anymore and you want to save this credit for the next smart contract. You can do that as well. Now you have this credit, it's, it's yours. And once done, uh, you will be brought back to the dashboard and you'll actually will create another card for you, which, but that card will actually say uh, mainnet here instead of testnet. And it will have exactly the same menu, exactly the same metrics uh, that go with it. And that's pretty much it. Thank you very much. Bye.